Hello everyone. There are some new features added in TradePoint today. Some features needs explanation on how to use shortcut keys. So if you go to chart section, you can see shortcuts for each chart. We have added uh, shortcuts for relative strength chart, straddle and strangle, etc. On each type of charting method. So for example, if you press Control O, you can open a bar or candlestick or line chart. Press Z and you can zoom it. You can simply right click on the chart and select dark mode or light mode. For example, for the light mode, it is selected. Now you open the chart, it will open in the light mode. You select dark mode again, it will open in the dark mode. Now you can simply drag this dialog box window and uh, adjust it as per your requirement. You can add indicator, any indicator below the chart and you can adjust the size of that indicator as well. You can add up to five indicators below the chart. And as many indicators as you want on the chart. It is applicable on all type of charting methods. You can go to windows and tile it the way you want. Now you can see this uh, border. If you want to remove this, just press A on the chart and it disappears. If you want to bring it back, press A again and it will come back. You can also remove this dialog box or commentary section. Just press N on the chart and it will disappear. Now, if you are using multiple charts on your screen, for example, I'll add Renko chart and line break chart. Now I press N. I remove this border by pressing A. And there is no dialog box on the chart. If you want to see a common window for showing the data points of each chart, you can go to option and click on data window. This is a common data window. Wherever your cursor is, you will see the reading of that particular charting type. It will show all the important information of the chart and also the commentary section information. If you want to fix this window, that's on the right side, just press R and it will move to the right side. If you press L, it will go to the left side. So if it is on the right side, you want to fix it here, just go to window and click on time. Now this will be fixed. Now you can look at different charts. You can save on the space for the data window and the border and you can see the uh, information in this dialog. You can also decide on these box values through user preference. Go to the user preference, click on P and F. You can see the options for box size one, two, three, four. Same way you'll see options for Renko brick size one, two, three, four. So you can change it as per your requirement. And if you want to close this data window, just press A, close this. You can bring the borders back by pressing A. You can also bring the data window back by pressing N and tile it to see it in this moment. So these were the important keyboard shortcuts which we wanted to explain in this video. There are many other features added in this version and many others are coming in uh, next version. Hope you like these features and find that useful. Thank you for your time.